Good morning to all of you in audience. Thank you for choosing to be a part of our morning devotions yet another day. My name is Jacqueline Hart and I represent Pastors Lloyd and Noma Hart of Revival Time Assembly in San Fernando. And we are continuing on the topic, Life's Choices. And the sub theme today is choose obedience over disobedience. Obedience is not something that is fostered on us when we grow older but it must start when we are babies. Yes, babies, look at toddlers. At an early age, they know to tell us no for everything. And it is a continuous task of telling and showing them the right thing to say and do. As we grow older, it is good for us to obey our parents, for this prepares us to be obedient to God and to be obedient as adults. In Deuteronomy 30, verse 20 says that thou mayest love the Lord thy God and thou mayest obey his voice and that thou mayest cleave or cling unto him for he is our life and the length of our days that thou mayest dwell in the land which the Lord swore unto thy fathers to Abraham, to Isaac and to Jacob to give them. How can we walk in obedience to God. We cannot walk with God or obey him if we don't know him. We need to get to know him. We need to accept Jesus Christ into our lives first and get to know him by reading our Bibles and praying and worshiping him. The Holy Spirit is there to teach us and to lead us, instruct and correct us and guide us in all truth. Serving Jesus calls for being obedient. In Ephesians 6 verses 1 to 3 it says, Children, obey your parents in the Lord, for this is right. Honor thy father and thy mother, which is the first commandment with promise, that it may be well with thee, and thou mayest live long on the earth. So we recognize that obeying not only our parents, but obeying God, Give us life and long life. Do we want to live long on the earth? Honor your mother and father. Some of us are not even spe on speaking terms with our parents. And this must be corrected right away. Do as the Bible says, and you will have many benefits of long life on this earth. Join us tomorrow as we continue our morning devotions on life choices. Have a blessed day.